My newest book project is a co-edited collection of essays on Southern women, aging, and creativity. We're on that soon. Um, and I thought to connect with that project, I'd like to start reading some poems about the process of aging. So I'm going to start with one of my very favorite poems by Mae Sarton. It's called, Now I Become Myself. Now I become myself. It's taken time, many years and places. I have been dissolved and shaken, worn other people's faces, run madly as if time were there, terribly old, crying a warning. Hurry, you will be dead before, what? Before you reach the morning or the end of the poem is clear or love safe in the walled city. Now to stand still, to be here, feel my own weight and density. The black shadow on the paper is my hand. The shadow of a word as thought shapes the shaper falls heavy on the page is heard. All fuses now, falls into place from wish to action, word to silence. My work, my love, my time, my face, gathered into one intense gesture of growing like a plant. As slowly as the ripening fruit, fertile, detached, and always spent, falls but does not exhaust the root. So all the poem is, can give, grows in me to become the song, made so and rooted by love. Now there is time and time is young, Oh, in this single hour, I live all of myself and do not move. I, the pursued, who madly ran, stand still, stand still, and stop the sun. That is Now I've Become Myself by Mae Sarton for the Midweek Poetry Break. <laughs>